Hey, what's up, guys? Eskazoo here, and welcome to episode 4 of Fatal Man of the Match. And in our previous episode, we managed to collect 210k. And as always, I gave you guys two options of place which you were able to choose from. And uh, we start off with pair 1. We have the squad button challenge version of Lacazette and also CD Bay. And as pair 2, we have Lacazette again and also the Movember version of Matuidi. And uh, pair 1 was a winner, so that means we're going to be adding those two players to the side. We stick to the false 9 formation and uh, everyone is on full chemistry. So uh, hopefully at the end of this episode, we're able to uh, upgrade maybe the defense or something. But anyway, um, also in the previous episode, I gave you guys uh, uh, some options about the substitute player and the new substitute player we're going to be adding to the side is actually going to be Gareth Bale and uh, you can see at the bottom left we actually have three players already as our substitutes so uh, those are the three players we're able to use after 45th minute but anyway we're going to go will be the first game and we come up against this team with also the second inform or the third inform version of Memphis Depay a couple other informs as well including uh, Balotelli and uh, he had a really nice looking team so if we managed to win this game we, uh, we had some nice players to, uh, to choose from and uh, we started off this game really really great with some great chances as well from kickoff immediately uh, from a corner or two went with a scissor kick with Lacazette which went wide but uh, we managed to set a lot of pressure on my opponent already then uh, in the 11th minute here he gets himself a really nice attack going a nice volley there as well from Tao Van. but then when I actually look back at this goal I noticed it was actually offside and you can see it from this frame you can see that number nine at the bottom is actually offside but the referee decided to let it go for me, the first time that I actually like notice something in the game, because usually um, when FIFA says it's, it's offside, it usually is offside actually. But it's the first time I actually noticed that they are wrong. So, yeah, it's kind of odd. Let me know in the comments if you uh, notice something similar as well in any uh, FIFA game. But anyway, uh, moving on here in the 26th minute, another chance there. Through ball to Tauvan, good save there from Neuer. Wasn't really the greatest shot either. Then a 32nd minute, picks up a free kick here, pass it off to Mario Balotelli, but again an easy save for Manuel Neuer. And uh, those are pretty much the chances he had in the first half. Then 43rd minute, we get a cross in there with a right back, Deepmeyer reaching out to the pie, which unfortunately couldn't uh, head it in. And that's how the first half ended. And you can see from the stats, we had most of the possession, also most of the chances, but we only had one shot on target. And uh, we definitely had to improve that. So into the second half we go again with a big chance already. We started the second half and we hit the frick post there with Douglas Costa would have loved to see that one go in uh, would have been a really nice start to the second half as well but no luck there the 58th minute here a chance with Bill which he for some reason went with a header I don't really know why because I think he could have easily gone with a volley but um, yeah another chance wasted there and after it we create more and more chances but we seriously just couldn't score here as well with the pie, a good save there from the goalkeeper. Then uh, 69th minute, we almost lost the ball on the left hand side. And uh, the pie crossed it in here, trying to go for a header with build. And we go with a volley here with Lacazette, which unfortunately went wide as well. A few minutes later, he uh, made a big mistake with his defense. Uh, we played on through here to Douglas Costa. One to pass it back to Lacazette. Got locked on to Ben Arfa, who unfortunately hit this uh, defender. Then we got a shot in here with Thiago, which went wide as well. And I mean, I can say it more and more, but we had so many chances in this game. His goalkeeper saved so many as well, and it was just our our like our attackers which couldn't score, which was really really annoying because I felt that if I had to go into extra time, I uh, probably would lose this game because of the players like in my team they were completely dead when it comes to fitness and stuff. And uh, you can see from the stats, yes, some good chances too, but we definitely had to score at least once in this game. So we go into extra time, and uh, we already start off with a big mistake where we almost scored from here with the pie. But a great save there from uh, Manu Anor to keep us into the game. Then uh, our second substitute here, Gabriel Jesus, the five-star skiller, goes on the attack here. Picks it up here with uh, Douglas Costa. I want to uh, do a sort of a back heel um, to like pass it back to Gabriel Jesus. But unfortunately, the goalkeeper was there. Then one and fifth minute, another big mistake from our defender. Good save there from uh, Neuer as well. And uh, in the second half of extra time, he also decided to sub on uh, Salah, who was obviously uh, full when it comes to his fitness. And he almost scored there. He hit the post. So we got very, very lucky there towards the end. And uh, that's how the 19 minutes ended. So we had to go into a penalty shootout. And my opponent started off terribly. I don't know if this was actually on purpose, but uh, he completely missed that penalty. Then the first one for us with Garibel. We slotted home. Uh, we, uh, we take the lead in the penalty shootout. Then he makes it 1-1 here with uh, Higuain. And from this moment onwards, it went uh, quite bad for us. Because for some reason, when I took this penalty, it went to the right, even though I held uh, the left stick in the middle. Like, I don't know what it is, maybe my controller, maybe I wasn't really paying attention that much. But um, yeah, we missed the penalty, unfortunately. Very lucky with this one as well with Memphis Depay. Uh, he steps up for his uh, third one, which he slots home as well, or his fourth one, I mean. Then the same thing happens here with Douglas Costa. Again, I, I tried to shoot it into the middle, but the goalkeeper saved. 
And then this penalty is final one. If he scored this one, he would win the game. I knew what he was going to do. He went with the chip shot. I just knew it from the from the beginning already because of kind of the way he was playing. And yeah, Manuel Neuer again messed up completely. I held the left stick in the middle. Uh, I probably shouldn't have touched that uh, that left stick because it completely messed it up for me. But um, yeah, he scored that chip shot. Really nice way to win him the game, but uh, it really frustrated me because I felt I should have won this game. But um, that's how FIFA goes. You can see top right, uh, minus 30k. So in the second game, we uh, we definitely have to score some uh, some goals in order to actually uh, get some upgrades going. So we go to the second game, come against a La Liga side with, again, uh, some really good players into his team. So um, yeah, I wasn't too sure what to expect. But we started off good as well in the 20th minute, hit the crossbar or the post. Uh, with Thiago, unfortunately couldn't get a rebound going. Then uh, a few minutes later, Lacazette here on the ball as well, goes through. Uh, wasn't too sure what to do, so I just decided to sprint through uh, to the corner. Cut in here with the Berber, spent a good shot. And then from the rebound, the pie with a big chance, but he refused to score. And uh, the goalkeeper saved it fairly easy. And you can see from the halftime, we uh, definitely should have scored at least once. Because we had a lot of chances, but still it was nil-nil. Really annoying way to go into the second half. Uh, we made a chance, uh, brought on Garrett Bill, and uh, he definitely made my play style a lot better because uh, he obviously is one of the best players in the game, and uh, he felt uh, he felt really well whilst I was playing with him. You can see after like five minutes or so when he was on the pitch, he already made it 1-0. Unfortunately, not on his debut, but uh, still a very important goal to uh, to give us a lead in this game. Then uh, we move on a few minutes later. Uh, we took a shot with Lacazette, which I thought was actually going out of play, but uh, we managed to keep it in very nicely with Douglas Costa go with the roulette to beat the defender and we cross it in at the near post to our striker Lacazette who heads it into the back of the net uh, just like Ronaldo does you can see from the jump he was completely free and um, yeah a really nice way to make it 2-0 within only like a few minutes of time then uh, again only a few minutes later Thiago here on the ball uh, goes with the 1-2 here with Ben Arfa uh, eventually he gets it back then uh, we play it on through to the left hand side to Memphis Depay cuts in with the Berber spin cuts in on his weak foot cross it in to Lacazette who again was completely free and uh, he heads it on to make it 3-0 and gets his second goal of the game. And um, yeah, as soon as we brought on Bill, we uh, we played much and much better. I'm not too sure if it was just uh, Bill like actually um, making like such a big impact. Uh, because it was actually, like I said, who scored a hat-trick right there. But um, yeah, he definitely played really well. I'm really, really happy uh, that you guys actually chose him. So uh, props to you guys. But um, yeah, we make it 4-0 here with our striker, like I said, as I mentioned, who completes his hat-trick. Then in the 86th minute, I really want to score at least one more goal to uh, to go over that 100k in total. Um, even though we're already on 120k uh, from this game, we uh, still have to deduct the, the coins from the previous game, which was minus 30k. So, um, yeah, unfortunately, we weren't able to do that, but uh, we still won 4-0. Uh, you can see from the stats, a lot of chances for us. Probably could have scored more goals, but, um, yeah, we ended up winning the game 4-0. And that means our coin total, the coins we're able to spend, is 90k. And, um, yeah, we're going to be moving on to the pairs. Pair 1 is going to be a Bundesliga pair in Vidal and also the upgraded version of Socrates from uh, Borussia Dortmund. So that is pair one and pair two we have uh, Socrates again and also the Movember version of Matuidi so we can either go with another player from the league one or another player from the Bundesliga. So um, yeah let me know in the comments down below which pair I should go with. Um, also at the top right you can see the icon right there where it says uh, which pair is your favorite. Uh, make sure to vote because it's kind of a new voting system I want to do for Fatal and it worked out really well in the previous episode so uh, I'll probably just stick to it as well. Um, also for the new substitute player we can only choose from the second team so yeah just like in the previous episode I will leave straw poll and that way you uh, you guys are able to choose which player we're going to be adding in the next uh, episode as well as our new substitute but anyway that's where we're going to be adding off this episode hope you enjoyed it if you did then make sure to leave a like would be very much appreciated so thank you very much for watching and i will see you guys later bye bye